It's correct that the United States of America, China and former USSR have landed on the lunar surface, but no country has landed on the south pole of the moon. And that is exactly what India is going to attempt and land. This is going to be important. Remember, why has India chosen the south pole region? We tried to decode it for you and India will become the first country to be doing that. Take a look at this report. Three, two, one. We have ignition. The moon is just 25 kilometers below India's Chandrayaan-3. As a new chapter begins in India's moon tryst, a billion people are praying for its successful landing. The Vikram lander is aiming to land on the lunar south pole, which is a difficult feat. So what makes the soft landing near the lunar south pole incredibly difficult? The south pole of the moon's rugged terrain lies in the shade of perpetual darkness and plummeting temperatures. This is where researchers had previously discovered the presence of frozen water. Chandrayaan 3's successful landing will expand knowledge of frozen water on the moon, potentially one of the moon's most valuable resources. Scientists are interested in pockets of ancient water ice because they could provide a record of lunar volcanoes, materials that comets and asteroids delivered to Earth, and the origins of oceans. If water ice exists in sufficient quantities, it could be a source of drinking water for moon exploration and could help cool equipments. It could also be broken down to produce hydrogen for fuel and oxygen to breathe, supporting missions to Mars or lunar mining. Attempted landings on the moon have failed before. Russia's Luna 25 craft had been scheduled to land on the South Pole this week but spun out of control on approach and crashed on Sunday. The South Pole, far from the equatorial region, targeted by previous missions, including the crude Apollo landings, is full of craters and deep trenches. Chandrayaan-3 is proposed to land in the plateau between two craters, Manzanus and Bogus Lossky and a third, Sympelius. Additionally, an alternate landing site has also been proposed. At the mountainous South Pole, the terrain is difficult and dangerous with major craters, minimal sunlight and temperatures below minus 300 degree Fahrenheit. If all goes according to plan, Chandrayaan-3 is poised to achieve a historic milestone as the world's first Luna mission to execute a soft landing near the moon's south pole. Bureau report, India Today.